Hey everybody, it's MP4 from SlateDroid.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to upgrade your firmware or replace the firmware on your Hero Tab M802. Um, now the tablet that I'm using I got from um, Mary Mobiles and it is, it is the single uh, speaker one. Um, now I got a lot of this information from a some from a site of a very good friend of ours uh, called um, Hardcore Forensics. The Hardcore Forensics site specializes in the hardware modification of these um, tablets, but they do some um, of the firmware listings also too. So it's a great site. So if you have one of these tablets, I definitely definitely recommend that you join up with these guys. All right, uh, but let's jump back over to our site. So we're going to jump into our download section. Now when you're on our download section you're going to see that I've already um, uh, downloaded the, the firmware and stored it onto our F FTP servers to make it easier for you guys to go ahead and, and grab. So everything you need is right here. Um, now this says with working root, it's supposed to say with, with working market. I apologize, I'll fix that in just a second. But it's, it's with working market um, and roots are easy. You only actually need this file right here, but shh, don't tell anybody. Okay, so with working uh, market. Now this is a full firmware replacement and this is just the upgrade. That's why it says upgrade only. So we're going to concentrate on doing the upgrade one first and then we'll show you how to replace the firmware if you want to replace the firmware. Okay, so when you are, uh, once you download this firmware you're going to get a folder that looks like this. That It's not going to have this in it. Um, it's, it's only going to have these four files right here. Now once you get these four files and you unzip them you're going to need to plug in your 30-pin uh, connector and your well your 30-pin connector with your USB plug on the end of it. You're going to need to plug that into your computer so that you can get your USB set up. Now your your computer is going to sorry your tablet is going to come up and and have something that's going to say do you want to connect to USB storage and you're going to just going to click OK. Now I'm going to show you a picture of that so that you know where I'm going with this. All right, so you're going to say OK, and it's going to show you these three, uh, three drives. Your E drive, or for me, my E drive is my internal SD card that stores the firmware for my Hero tab. So I'm going to click on that. Now you see I've already transferred these files over into my um, root directory of my 4 gig uh, internal storage S SD card. Um, so that's what you're going to need to do. You're going to need to grab the grab these image files from here and bring them over here to your root directory. Now this is going to take maybe two three minutes but once that's done um, you're going to go ahead and of course uh, unattach your cables from your Hero tab and I'm going to show you now we're going to go to the camera to show you what it looks like when you are actually loading the updates to this. Alright so here we go. Okay, so this is the screen that you want to get into. You want to get into your Android system um, recovery uh, folder. Now, to, to get there, what I did was I, you know, it, it has to be off completely, and I turned it on while pushing this button over to the right while holding this button right here. Okay, so this, so this button up here on the top over to the right while pushing this button right here. So... Once I'm in there, I'm going to uh, select update RAM disk. Now I'm not going to do this one because I've actually changed the firmware out on this one completely. I'm going to do update RAM disk first, and that's going to go through the process. And I like a, a, also I recommend plugging this in so that you don't lose power in the middle of this change because it could take a few minutes. And then once I've updated the RAM disk, I'm going to update the system, and that's going to take. It could take. 10, 10 minutes but just be patient and that's why you want to plug it in All right. once that's done I'm going to select reboot system which is the very top one so we're gonna do RAM disk first and then we're gonna do update system second and then we're going to reboot the system entirely alright so let's do that so uh, like I said it could take up to 10 minutes so just be patient with everything so we're going to do the reboot and it's going to reboot and go into the system. I just want to show you that market is working on this now. All right, so now that we got our um we got everything installed, I'm going to show you that market does work and I've already got it set up. Now your market may look a little different than this. Like I said, this is the tablet 
the, the one I'm using I did a total uh, firmware change out so the market may look a little different but this is the market and it works just fine and also I'm going to show you that because I, I downloaded Angry Birds Seasonal Season, sorry, Seasons and all I can say is that um, you guys don't want to challenge me on this because I am the Angry Birds master. Oop, okay. Th that was just a warm up, so that one doesn't really count. Ugh. So, <laughs> so anyway, um, as you see, everything is, <laughs> is working. If I can, if I can stop. I'm just showing you guys. I don't want to show you guys how good I really am because I don't want you to come to the site um, and challenge me at it. So, but anyway, as you see, <laughs> everything is working. Crazy. Um, on the tablet, we got our we got uh, Angry Birds going. Well, I don't know why that opened up. Go back to there. But you see, market is working. So go ahead and jump on and 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 grab your um, copy and, and enjoy. All right, guys. This is MP4 for uh, SlateDroid.com. Um, wishing you guys a happy holidays and um, thanks for everything guys. Bye.